Okay, wait, I need to go to the hospital's house quarters next. To sender. Okay. Hello there. The trainer? Ain't no merchant, ain't no trader. Got no coin, got no bread. So what are you needing out of me? What training do you do, bro? Stealth training. Ain't good at much, but I don't need to be noticed if I ain't looking to be. For a bit of coin, I can teach anyone to be the same. Things used to be better here. Now Apatia is looking like the better option, thanks to you. I heard what you did. Thanks. Hey, no worries, man. I hear you helped start cleaning it up. I'm sure you have the people's thanks for that. Used to do a tour or two as an archer with some mercenaries. They turned to banditry and I... I just turned to ale. Him. Ain't the sandstone villa from what I hear. But I've slept in worse places, I can promise you that. Yeah, yeah. Alright, alright. Ooh, what is this? Though the long road enjoys independence from the jurisdiction of Odessa, it relies on divine and local providence to deal with threats and problems. To all passes by that can help, please answer these petitions. Redistributing wealth. Let's see, the human and Alfar merchants of the Arcadium are respected and affluent figures in the city, but they refuse to aid their brothers and sisters in the hospitalis quarters with charity or cheaper custom. Please, would some kind soul convince them to have pity on the poor and meek? Ablir will see the kind soul rewarded. Let's see, delivering a message. S-clad Tainer has been held in the other prison for weeks just for stealing a loaf of bread and have forbidden us from speaking with him. Please, someone deliver this letter of our love and well wishes to him in the prison without attracting the Praetorians. Ablier will see to a reward. Oh, damn. Alright, then the Prester's Path. Though the long road enjoys independence from jurisdiction of Edessa, it relies on divine and local providence to deal with threats and problems. To all passes by, that can help. Wait, writing or wrong? The gnomes have seized what little we could send to help the armies in Melson Shear, holding them in the armory. Destroy them all. If the beleaguered armies can't have them, no one can. Reward 150 gold. What? Huh. Okay. Interesting. Uh, what's this? Beetle's office? There's another trainer up here. Yeah. Hmm. Always happy to see a new face. Been some time since we've had a new arrival. Hey, hell yeah. Hello. Hello once more. It seems we just keep running into each other. I know how to make a door open when it doesn't want to, if that's what you're asking. Pretty useful in a city with a few secrets. Odessa is different from Rathia. Everything about this city is planned, all its details already known. Rathia was built so haphazardly it would keep surprising you. Most don't want to live here, but we Wiles have been refugees since the Tuatha first attacked. We're just happy to stop running. I came to Odessa with my brother Harrit and my sister Gwenvere. We were only children when we had to flee the fires of war, but here we are. Wretched curs, all of them. If it weren't for my siblings, I'd be fighting them even now. What does that mean? Wait, is a merchant? Of course it's up top. Mm -hmm. 
I? What? Yeah, we've no clean mugs and no clean beds. There is no tavern business running today. Hmm. You have anything good? Saw that. All right. Not bad, I guess. Good. Oh, there's a quest here. What's this? Red name. Well, don't suppose I'm speaking to the new guest of the Sandstone Villa. I heard someone had taken occupancy there. I suppose you've come to the quarters to slum it, eh? Or are you inclined to lend a hand here? What hell do you need? We're in a curious position here. The gnomes are obliged to help us, but they don't really want us dirtying up their city. So they shove us in here. Better than the wastes, but not by much. And if we try to improve the situation, we'll be turned out. We need someone who can stand up for us without getting us evicted. And who isn't afraid of... Bending some gnomish laws. What work do you mean? Well, it's not all legal. There's petitions to destroy some contraband in the armory, and one to smuggle a letter to a man in prison. But there's also one to get the merchants in the Arcadium to share their profits. That's more straightforward. See, maybe if you pay me well. I, I think that might be an order. Here's an advance for your help. You'll get the rest when the jobs are finished. You can find the petitions board in the quarters. Answer two of them and I'll hold the job complete. Avlier can tell you more about the tasks. And will reward you for doing each one. Nice. Where are the petitions? There's a board in the quarters where the people make petitions to improve things around here. Avlier keeps the board. Speak with him if you have more questions. The gnomes built this place for their achievements. Don't mistake that. If you're valuable to them, you're in. And if you're not, you're out of luck. <laughs> Let's just say I had my ear to the ground and learned that someone important was staying in Sandstone Villa. Someone of means. The gnomes gave us the quarters and told us it was this or the wastes, so we had to make it work. I had to make it work. I knew a thing or two about keeping coins. Didn't take long for me to earn more than any of these poor sods could hope. Gnomes didn't like that. <laughs> so long. Okay. Hmm. Alright, time to go back down. Oh my god, I just killed a chicken. <laughs> Freaking orb. Just wrecked it, bro. Okay, so let's see. I need to. Let me go ahead and deliver the package. Hey, what's this place? Grand Bursars. Bursars. There we go, another quest. Hey, little dude. Yeah, uh, this won't do. This won't do at all. Profits haven't been up since... Hmm? Oh, yeah, excuse me. You're the courier, yes? Good. You're early. We can begin at once. Begin what exactly? Why, the delivery to the Mortis Mining Branch office in the Hollowlands. Now, it seems we've uh, misplaced our copy. So you'll have to reclaim the handbook from my old headquarters in Apotir. What's this job again? I need someone to go to the Mortis headquarters in Apotir and recover a handbook. Then deliver it to the Mortis headquarters in the Hollowlands. Alright, sure. Good. You should go to the old Mortis mining offices in Apotir. Once you've found the book, bring it to a poor wire. Yeah, remember that guy. I need a courier to go to the closed Apotir branch of Mortis mining and recover the branch handbook. Then... 
take it to Mortis Mining's new branch office in the Hollowlands. Simple enough, isn't it? Many have sought shelter from war within our walls. We have offered what we can to these outsiders, who built the city in exchange. I am the head clerk of Mortis Mining's home office. It was so important, the bursars even gave me a chest in their vault. Oh, damn. Though privately controlled, we are significant enough to be integrated into several municipal services. The bursars finances our expeditions now. The walls are the center of Odessa's labors. Every gnome gladly dedicates his or her life to the furthering of our great civilization. Fine. Is there anything else in here? Yeah, a bunch of freaking chests. Holy crap. Let's get out of here. Let's go check out the aisles. And deliver this message. So there really isn't much here other than the forum. Wait. Actually, I think what? it's just... A matter of searching. <laughs> Covering Brother Till's books, huh? Keep the peace, stranger. I know you are welcome to Sandstone Villa, but we've no need for any outside trouble. Odessa is a coveted prize. We've turned a barren stretch of desert into an oasis of knowledge. So we Praetorians must protect it. I am the leader of the Praetorian Watch within the Isles. Me and my guards ensure that nothing jeopardizes the institutions we've built here. We are the backbone of Gnomish society. The scholars are the brain, and the Templars are the will. But we... we are the means. Very well. Hmm. The means, eh? It's a librarium. What? It's basilica. What? Let me grab this quest real quick. Who's there? <laughs> well, look at you. Don't seem to be quite as busy as the other humans working the scaffolding. You might be perfect. Listen, stranger, would you like to earn a bit of coin? No sweat off your brow, promise. What's this experiment about? I don't know all the details about it. I assist many scholars with their works here. I know that Scar Narin was involved in linguistics. It's safe to say the experiment will likely be some verbal study. Where can I get started? Scar Narin has quarters in the Basilica Nostra. Speak with her and she'll get you started. How can I start this experiment? You need to speak with Scar and Narin in the Basilica Nostra. She'll tell you what to do. Every now and then, the scholars take an assistant from the laboratories in the walls to the Basilica. Right now, that's me. The Basilica is where the scholars of Odessa reside. Not many assistants there besides me, but I manage. Lost? The Basilica Nostra is home to Odessa's scholars. The Forum is the center of Odessa, and behind that, is a Livrarium, Odessa's library. The Consistorium is, well, under construction. The scholars are the most educated gnomes. You could say they are the thinkers of our society. Even in its unfinished state, the Forum is a perfection of architecture, a fitting place for the seat of our government. The Livrarium is our storehouse of knowledge. The works of many scholars, sages, historians, and mages can be found within. Hmm. Hmm. Looks cool. Oh, this is, this is from the screenshot. The loading screen, I mean. I'm sure there's something in here. No? 
blessing. This is a marvelous city to walk, isn't it? To look down on the crater from the walls, or up at our buildings from the aisles. Truly breathtaking. Damn, what? Persuasion? Ah. Oh. The art of rhetoric is essential for any Templar to master. And of course, I excel at it more than anyone. But such knowledge is better shared, agreed? This city will be a beacon to all of the other races, to let them know of our artistry, our resilience, and our mastery of knowledge and magic. I sponsor many of the scholars of physiology and humoral applications in the Basilica Nostra. With all that's happening, the world will need healers. The Templars are the leaders of the Gnomish people. We are many, and sometimes at odds. But we have the goodness of our people, all peoples, in our heart. Be well. Nothing, nothing. Blessings to you. Blessings to you. So whatever. It's not nothing great anyway. Blessings to you. <laughs> you wish to speak? All right, let's go deliver this package. Silicon Nostra. And there is Speak with Scholar Noreen. Blessings to you. Scholar Aaron Court. Yes, there is much I have to do. I don't have time for everyone that comes looking for me, even if they are the guests of Sandstone Villa. The scholars first found this crater brimming with strange potential. In studying the area, more equipment than people came until a city was born. While my background lies in the study of magical acuity contextualized by race, somehow I ended up being a basilical liaison to the domus concerning Fay and Alfar. It is the product of centuries of learning. Here we distill the experiences of our race into axioms, knowledge that future generations may live by. I see. Who's there? Alright. Let me go deliver this package. Speak to Scholar Noreen. Guessing they're upstairs. So long for these. There we go. There are some things you simply cannot do with ordinary blades. Beautiful, exquisite things. All right, creep. The city has no parallel, and it's only half built. I can't even conceive of all the contributions we will make to these lands in learning and policy. It is where the greatest minds of the gnomes, the scholars, can determine the underlying rules and laws of existence. From here, our power is born. I got my start doing vivisections in the laboratories. I showed enough knowledge of humoral balance and physiology that I was asked to join the Basilica. My colleagues are always at the forefront of research. I must stay at my best to keep up. Very well. Now, what's this quest? I have to talk to Noreen. Here we go, Silver Tongue. I met a gnomish lab assistant, Audern Race, in Odessa's Isles, who was trying to find subjects for a language experiment being performed by Scholar Noreen of the Basilica Nostra. Audern has told me that I should speak to Scholar Noreen and volunteer for the experiment. Well, 
When I sent Ordern to recruit subjects, I didn't think I'd find one quite as tall as yourself. But he has done well. In fact, I'd say you make the perfect test case for my newest work. This is a language test, right? In so many words, yes. I'm developing a potion vital for future diplomacy. One that will let the user understand foreign tongues. Interesting. But it requires calibration. Currently, the potion grants universal understanding, but it will not properly permit speech. I will administer a new formula. The spells in my lab shall localize the effects, so I can ask a few questions of you in various tongues. Fine, can we begin? Yes. Now, I will just administer the potion and we can begin. Yes. Oh, okay. If you can understand what I am saying, please tell me my name. <laughs> what the hell? Ziv uh, Ziv. What the hell? Well, on to the next question. <laughs> tell me, where can I find the Court of Summer? Cads they sit a foe. I see. Here is my final question. There is an army of Fae named the Tuatha. Tell me, where are they from? <laughs> he doesn't seem to understand what you mean. Yizgoy. Well, that was less successful than I would have liked, but the data <laughs> will be useful to me nonetheless. I'm happy to have had your help with this. Take these potions as a reward, with my thanks. Is it? The Basilica is currently funding more remote experiments than ever before. Why would they do so much work externally? Makes it difficult to keep track of it all. Not all the scholars are dedicated to academia. Some, like Aelily Aaroncourt, are put on bureaucratic duties between projects. It's not always ideal. I've specialized in the study of languages and discourse. Of course, the Basilica sees no end of political applications for my research, so I'm happy to be well funded. Yes? That was kind of quick. Okay, uh, maybe him? If you're here for trade, then go to the market. <laughs> Otherwise, just don't touch anything. <laughs> 